So you're telling me that you've just seen the footage, just witnessed him do what I've just told you that he's done, and you can't go in there and arrest him? No, it's not, not proportionate this time to go and arrest him. Why not? Because there's no necessity to. You can be questioned slow time about the offence. Um, yeah, and obviously you're not providing any of your details. We've got an email address, but it's not yeah, enough yeah. for me to... It's enough to raise it and start proceedings again. I can fill out my That's details at a later yeah, point. Yeah, yeah. So you put a report on anyway, yeah. in any case, and then obviously you want to do what you want to do, which is call up and give the rest of your details. Okay, fine. Um, well, we'll leave you to it. Obviously, we can't stop yeah. filming. All right, um, just, um, just, just, just for the, the record. Only concern is, because obviously for your safety as well, we've got cars speeding in here, especially if they've got a prisoner on board. Um, they might not, not see you if you're right that gate there. That's fine. I've made it this many years. I'll be fine. Just uh, so I know who I've made the report to, that's uh, AW... 1241 and yourself? Seven, uh, sorry, 2786. You're both based here at Charing Cross, yeah? yeah? Brilliant. Cool. Okay. Thank you. Any other questions? No, that's fine. Right. Just make sure he looked like a, either a detective because he was playing clothes or a senior officer, so he definitely shouldn't be doing shit like that, should he? Hello? What's it look like I'm doing? Spot on. Why are you filming the back of the police station? I was just to go ask the constables in there. Thank you. <laughs> what, from a public footpath? Good luck. Yeah, of course it is. Yeah, so that guy who came out um, and asked if uh, my channel's power to the proletariat, he's the one that came and approached me at MI5, so he knows the score, he knows what I'm doing, he knows that there's nothing that he can do about it. London is not having a good day today. Not at all.
Well, at least I know some of my views are coming from uh, <laughs> from these police officers. Then. time in the world to stand around chit chatting up there. I still have to go talk to the constables that have already been and talked to me. Yes. Yes. I'll talk to you again. So you'll talk to me again as well. Because okay. this might be a breach of security. Again? Okay. What law is a breach of security? Uh, it's a private premises. Oh, it's, 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 sorry, it's government premises. Am I on your premises? Uh, no, but you're filming inside the premises. Okay. So from this point on, whatever you're filming, it is government premises. Sure. So is Buckingham Palace. So is uh, Houses of Parliament. Of so is Houses of Parliament. I can film into it though. Yes. Of course I can. If they've got the door open or can if they've... Can I ask what's the, what's the reason? I suggest you talk to the constables. Uh, guys, can you just tell them to leave me alone? Thank you. Collar numbers, please. AW1822, AW2047. Thank you. I don't appreciate being filmed, okay? Picture, 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 picture. Don't approach somebody with a camera, then. Double yellow lines. I'm blocking the entrance. Bizarre. Interesting. Oh, we've got a CO4867 uh, in the driver's seat. I reckon this might be the guys, um, nah, it's not the guys that I annoyed earlier at uh, Liverpool Street because they were City of London police, this is Met Police. Thousands. Thousands of people. Uh, W1250 RT, beautiful. Beautiful bike, isn't it? Right, good morning. Good morning. Right, you are being recorded as well. Thank you. Um, can I ask what you're doing recording all the bikes and all the things? Oh, it's a beautiful bike, isn't it? Okay, so what are you doing hanging outside a police station? Well, at the moment, I'm waiting for a specific officer to get his collar number because he's assaulted me, so, and he refused to identify, so I'm waiting for him. Okay, so what is it? Who is that person? Well, I don't know because he hasn't identified, so that's what I'm waiting for, so I can ask him to identify again. Do you want to go to the front counter and, and, and maybe take it up with them? That uh, would be the, the right, well, you might not come through here. Okay. Well, like he, five he, might not. he might not, but, you know, I've, I've, got, I've got to pick one, haven't I? You know. Well, pick, 
pick the front office and then maybe ask for duty officer or something like that and then you can uh, go from there because as it stands you're just sitting here it looks a bit odd okay. and recording all the I'll tell you now I've spoken to six other constables yeah. since I've been stood here and they okay. all know what I'm doing and they've all left me to it they know who I am and that's fine so right. if you're concerned okay. I would suggest you go talk to them and they'll tell you well I'm not, I'm not concerned about them I'm concerned about you what all I'm right. saying is if you want to make a complaint or you want to sort of try and identify that person you could go to the front office mm -hmm. okay you can go yeah. to the front office and then you can do it that way. Okay. You fancy doing that? No, I'm good, thank you. Why is that not zooming out any further? Maybe it's already zoomed out. Right, just so, do me a favour. Obviously, don't. Who are you? Sorry, T5 38CO. Yeah. Thank you. 486. Um, do me a favour, though. Listen to me. It does look a bit odd that you're okay. recording. I don't so have do, to do, do me, you any listen, listen. No. Go yeah. back in your car, I don't have to do you any favours. Don't be rude. Well, I'm sorry, but you've come to me and trying to give me directives, so... No, I'm trying to help you. Well, I don't need your help. I don't need your help. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. Alrighty, goodbye. Try to help. Well, listen to me. Obviously, that's a secure gate and stuff, so don't go in there, don't do anything silly, okay? Well, I'm not going to go in any complain, secure areas, am I? Go that way, and there's, a, there's an entrance, All right, okay? cool. Okay, good <laughs> Oh, dear Lord. Failed intimidation tactics. Yep. Can you disappear, please? Nope. How rude are you? Bugger off. That's how rude. He's gonna write down in his notepad. That's it. Drive off. <laughs> uh, and that's how you get the police to do uh, driver shame.
Love it. I don't know if you heard that cop uh, said good afternoon as he's walking off behind me he said he's got a fun life, hasn't he? So I said I love it. I don't think I see any sign of that uh, idiot that assaulted me coming out anytime soon. So I have to wrap this one up here, guys, and uh, head on. At least we've got that on footage. We've got a couple more interactions while we're here. Oh dear, oh dear. Good at all, guys. Not good at all. Look at all of the vehicles reverse out. Which I swear is an offence to reverse onto a public highway. It's a traffic offence. Well, yes, he's on duty, so actually that raises it to a malfeasance in public office, which is 14 years in jail. It'd, it'd be a complaint. No, 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 it would be 14 years in jail. Whether he's on duty or not, an assault is an assault. If he gets, if he, it, gets in, it gets investigated internally before it becomes... Yeah, well, so, so the police, the, the, the police investigate the police for misconduct. That seems legit. That's how it works. That's that's how it works. Um, it's on the website. It's quite clear. It says thanks and complaints. It's on on your phone. It's, it's got like a drop down. I'll, I'm not going to do it through the police. I'll do, it, I'll do it through IOPC. Oh yeah, you can do it. Like, yeah, because yeah. IOPC are wow. Well, they claim to be independent, but you know what happens when you put through to IOPC? They kick it back to the sergeant first, and that's what they do. Is so stupid. But that's that's the way to do it. Um, yeah. Well. Yeah. 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 That is, um, that is shocking, to be honest. Uh, police fail to act on an assault because he's on duty and it's misconduct instead. I mean, yeah, it is misconduct, but it's still an assault. It's still a criminal yeah, It's, it's still a criminal if matter. If it gets investigated to that point, that's how it will go, but it gets investigated internally, irregardless. So, but it's, a really simple, it's, it's almost easier than actually making a full crime report on the website. Mm. I would like to give you guys something to do. You seem to wander around not doing a lot, a lot of the time. Well, I mean, I've literally, when I first got into London today, uh, outside the train station, two vehicles parked up, and I was uh, filming them, parking on WR, both of them, chatting through, win through the windows of the vehicle. So I said to them, I was like, are you on duty? And uh, eventually got out of them that they are. And, uh, and then I said, well, you just sat around chatting through the window, popping into shops, buying coffee and snacks. I was like, 
could you not be patrolling, doing some paperwork, something like that? So, oh, we are patrolling. He's like, yeah, it looks like it's sat on a double yellow line, it's talking through a window. And he's like, well, we've got nothing to do at the moment, there's nothing coming through. I was like, but, you know, very underfunded. It's like, uh, Squid Game tattoo. No, no, no. Oh, no. Hey, just large PS4. <laughs> <laughs> Missing yeah. the X. We're gonna have to get rid of it one day or we'll cover it up. You need to get rid of it. Now, mate. <laughs> if only the men had strict policy on tattoos. Well, I appreciate. I think. I think it's uh, absolute bullshit. I do appreciate that. Okay. That's not. Like, I appreciate that's coming from somebody above you. Um, you know. So, but yeah, that's fine. I'll. Uh, Enjoy the rest of the oh, day, mate. Might have to petition the government to change your policies, guys. It's ridiculous. <laughs> Fair enough, mate. <laughs> Maybe they should hire us to uh, investigate you guys when things go wrong. We'll give you a fair trial. So those two have been fairly reasonable. When I tried to report it to them, they uh, were about to try and worm their way out of it. I set them straight on the dime, not even going to give them the opportunity. Um, so, yeah. Well, with that one, guys, uh, more police corruption here at Charing Cross. Uh, unlawful directives, unwanted advice, unsolicited advice, and yeah, assault by a copper. What a knob. That will be a definite IOPC and it will be a claim through with HNK. Um, so I have already made contact with them regarding last week so I believe all those vehicles there are also parked on double yellow lines these ones are parked on single right, double yellow lines not interested thank you answer any questions not interested thank you That's no thank fine. you I'm all good thank you no oh, you, sir. oh inspector spe yes inspector Cornish yeah. uh, what's a double one that's uh, that's not just inspector that's higher than an inspector yeah. isn't it what's that no 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 double is inspector oh, okay. three, three is chief inspector three is chief oh, inspector nice to meet you my friend anyway, thank, thank you thanks, are you, you an inspector of this station no no I'm yeah. oh. working in central London at the moment but thank you for your interest in policing anyway well what well, I'm interested questions I can answer yes yeah so I've just been assaulted by a uh, cop from this station um, and I tried to report it to two constables, and they're trying to tell me that um, they, because he's on duty, it's more of a misconduct issue rather than an assault, yeah. and that they can't raise it criminally, and I have to do it through the complaints procedure. That's correct. Why is that? That's correct, because then the complaints procedure that can lead to criminal action against officers okay. if necessary. It's Absolutely. It's an investigation process. Yes, but the issue is, is who deals with that investigation? Most investigations are dealt with by our professional standards department. Some are referred to the IOPC. Mm -hmm. However, you can put your complaint directly with the IOPC. That's what I normally do. Wish, That's yeah. what I normally do. But do you know what the IOPC do when I do that? Kick it straight back to the sergeant in charge of those people. Not always. They don't always. They keep some investigations. Oh, really? Well, yeah. I mean, only like highly serious ones. So because, because he was on duty, yes, it's an assault, but that could also be classed as a malfeasance in public office. Uh, you know, abuse of his ex uh, exercise of uh, force. So, you know, he willingly did it, knowingly did it. So it's not misfeasance, it'll be malfeasance. And malfeasance carries a much harsher sentence than others who like him. So it's a shame. Um, I, I don't know if you know the, con uh, the inspector of this station um, or the chief constable of this borough um, or if you can contact them. But I, I would like to suggest to you, Inspector, you've been very courteous. But I would like to suggest to you that you make them aware of what's happened. Um, a couple of your constables have the picture of the gentleman on their body cam footage because I showed them on my phone so they're aware of who he is and obviously as you know what I'm doing you, you know it will be going on YouTube as well and uh, yeah, up, up to hundreds of thousands can see it uh, great well you've done uh, the right thing by reporting it yes, thank you very thank much you. no worries we'll leave you to filming thank you have Take a good day Inspector. all the best bye bye So guys, uh, yeah, not only do we have uh, 
corrupt police. The, well, the inspector was a nice enough guy, but uh, trying to explain to me why the procedure has to go through that way. Um, so, yeah, it's interesting. But yeah, just as I was wrapping up, you get a higher ranking constable come out, which is always interesting to see. parked on single yellows along here. I'm sure they've been here longer than the allowed amount of time. I do have a suspicion that I'm being followed guys. I don't know if you saw the civilian dressed male to the left of the inspector leaning against the wall. He was also around the corner and followed around the corner and I think someone to listen in what I'm saying to the inspector. So I'm just going to keep checking behind me momentarily to check on uh, if he's behind me. But he's not. So this is one of the other entrances that that uh, constable was telling me about. It's a vehicle only entrance. Got a bike, somebody on a bicycle, or is that a scooter down there? I don't think the camera's really picking that up. Just down there. Can't really tell. I think it might be a scooter. Interesting. Yeah, I'm not entirely sure. So guys, this has been PTTP in Westminster today, and uh, what a journey it's been. Um, it's been a bit of a wild ride, so I'm going to leave that one there, and I'm going to move somewhere else now, I think, still plenty early enough to get some more in. It's only 2.30 now, which is roughly the time I got here last week. There's still plenty of time to get more in. And uh, I shall catch you guys on the next one. As always, stay safe. Remember your rights. Hold them accountable. And as always, guys, power to the proletariat. Sarah. <laughs>